Hi there, it's Alan Bean and welcome to today's video. Today's video is all about groups and why you should be actually using them for your business. So join me after this brief intro and I'll explain how and why. See you in a minute. Right, welcome back then. So Facebook have got groups, they've got pages, they've got profiles, there's so much going on there. But I'm going to talk to you about groups which seems to be underused. Now briefly, just to cover the two of the major things, you've got your normal profile on Facebook, that should be your personal thing. Then you should have a page which is for your business side of things. Okay, everybody should have that set up. If you haven't, do it now and watch the rest of the video in a minute. The reason why you have a separate page for your business as opposed to your profile is basically pages is are allowed to discuss and do things that profiles aren't. If you put certain stuff up on your profile they can close your Facebook account whereas the same items can appear on your page and that's fine because that's business related but that's just a little thing there. So groups how to use groups in network marketing. Now, hopefully you've already got a group running in network marketing, but if you haven't, here's a couple of things about it. If you've got a team, a team group is a great place for people to communicate. 90% of network marketing teams have a group on Facebook. Give it a name, not your company name, not your name, but a name for your group, okay? Then people can ask questions, other members of the team can answer them. It doesn't have to be just your team, but your business. So you can say to people, you know, by all means, join the team website, join the group website, should I say, and contribute and you'll get answers back, okay? Great if you've got a couple of leaders as well that are willing to go in there occasionally and have a look and see if they can help. But what will happen is, over time, you'll get more and more people out of that. But that's not what I'm talking about groups for today for. The second type of group is your group. Now, let's say you've got a prospect. Um, we all have them time from time that are literally, you know that they're on their edge. It's not something that you miss. They're just something that they're the type of people that like to think about things. They like to get the facts behind them, right? So... By having a Facebook group that's set up with testimonials on it, with information on it, doesn't have to be any depth. Bear in mind you've probably already shown this person about the business opportunity, but they just want that extra bit, that extra bit of reassurance. You've told them about it, but maybe it's not you that they want to hear it from. Maybe somebody in your team who's got a testimonial or one that the uh, company that you work with has created put the video in there then you can guide people to there and let them have a look it's just a way of getting them information that they can look at their leisure and see if it's right for them now the one thing I would say to that is perhaps not leave them in too long certain so look I'll give you access to my uh, Facebook group for a week have a look at it any problems I'll give you a buzz at the end of the week if in the meantime you need to phone me, here's my details. Bear in mind this is people who are, you've already gone through your normal system, they are thinking about it, okay? So they can then go to that website and say you're talking to them on a Monday, but they don't have time on Thursday night. They know they can go and have a look at it and they've got time to digest the information. One thing you will always find in network marketing, your voice means so much, but when somebody else is saying exactly the same thing, it means what you've said becomes stone, becomes fact, whereas before it's just an opinion, okay? So by having testimonials there, you're building up your credibility as well. Okay, so that's just a little tip. Using a group, create it, brand it, and build it. Now, the extra thing that you can do if you've got a team is get team members to contribute to it. What I'm meaning is get them to occasionally put in 
little testimonials about what they've done in the business recently but monitor it why do I say monitor it because you will get people who leave your business but are still in the Facebook group the last thing you want is a competitor then going through all your prospects and taking them off and equally if you're letting other people into that group to look at it you need to have the time limit on okay <clears throat> The other thing is your team have to be aware there is no pinching prospects or anything like that if they're contributing and have access to that. So if you're talking of new, you've not got a team, just produce it. Or if you've got a small team, produce it with it's just facts in it. And to be honest, you may want to just leave it like that. I personally prefer that way. Then you're not having to go through on a regular basis and check that nobody's spamming your group that nobody is pinching other people off other people. The last thing you want to do is find that. And it's not nice, not nice. I've not had it in the company that I work with, but a previous company that did happen. And it happened to us where we had a prospect, we put him into the group and somebody signed him up within our team, but they just stole them, okay? As it was, that prospect wasn't very good anyway, so they didn't benefit from it, but it's not nice when it happens. So if you're going to have other people contributing, you need to make sure that they are fully aware this is for them to use for their prospects, but you're not going to pinch theirs and vice versa. Just common sense. Anyway, hopefully it helps somebody out there. If you want more information on any area of running your business, visit us on alanandcarolinebean.com or you can have a look at the link down below and that's who we use to help run our business and I think you'll find the training on there is fantastic there's even a trial period so you can try it out first speak to you very soon bye for now